Okay, so the next thing that we're going to talk about is the uh, core character components. So this includes things like um, the HUD controller, uh, the camera, um, you know, very important things for your player character to run properly. Now, just like this documentation says, this is included in every um, pre-built scene. So let me actually delete this. Um, this is included in every main underscore scene. Again, those main underscore scenes can found in, be found in any scenes directory. But I also, uh, on top of uh, providing a network manager for you, I provide these core components for you. They include things like the event system, the aim canvas for shooter controllers, uh, UI elements such as uh, you know the HUD here, uh, the third person controller, and all of these are already pre-converted. Um, and so most of the time you can actually just take this component and plop it into your project and maybe make a few tweaks to it, maybe save that as a um, variant prefab um, and you should be good to go. Um, but if you don't include these, you'll get errors at runtime. So like, for example, if you don't include, if you nest this third person camera in your player itself, it'll actually cause errors with the multiplayer system and it won't run properly. So these core components need to actually persist along with the network manager. So it's very important um, that you also don't duplicate these components. So it's it's kind of dangerous on these components to say don't destroy on load because it's very, very easy to duplicate those components. So these core components include the multiplayer uh, third person camera, the uh, HUD controller, this promo you can obviously remove, uh, you know, HUD for your characters, uh, aim canvas for like bows, uh, guns, uh, things like um, you know the melee manager, uh, the melee components. I generally don't have anything on an aim canvas. It's just the UI and the third person uh, camera. You can see those all in the main example scenes, and I encourage you to look at that. But uh, if you ever get errors at runtime, uh, that would be the very first thing I would check. 